And a local man says he's the victim of the knockout game. The 53-year-old says he was punched in the face Monday night, breaking his nose and knocking him unconscious for no reason. New at 6, WISN 12 News' Nick Bohr speaks with the man from his hospital bed. This is not a robbery situation. This is a pure act of violence. Tim Bissett's convinced his injuries are the result of the so-called knockout game seen recently around the country. Tim lives very near where he was attacked at Sherman and Burley and said, yeah, he'd worried about being robbed before, but never thought he'd be punched in the face and wind up here at Freighter Hospital, all because of somebody's amusement. I turned to my left to look to see if traffic was coming, and that's when they, right between, right in the nose, and... Uh, it just, I went down, um, I had a big goose egg right here, and uh, there was a big pool of blood leaking from my nose. And were you unconscious? Were you knocked out? Yes, I was knocked out, and it, 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 that's why when this was not a robbery, it was strictly a knockout game that they're playing. And they never took anything from you? Absolutely nothing, absolutely nothing. And I distinctively remember yet hearing them laughing and making wisecracks as they took off. Tim's being monitored for a brain injury. I got lucky. I got real lucky. I'm sitting here talking to you today. Um, the next person might be lying in the morgue. At Freighter Hospital, Nick Borf, WISN 12 News.